Because WeWeb is a front-end builder, you will need to connect your project to external data sources to make it dynamic. That's where data collections come in. So in WeWeb, assuming you have added at least one data source plugin. Here, for example, we added the Superbase plugin. Assuming you have it added at least one data source plugin, you can go to the data tab and create a new collection. So let's do this here. I'll call this my habits. Select the source. In this case, I only have one available source. If I had added several plugins, I would have several. And click continue. Now I can select the table in Superbase where I want to get the data. So in this case, it is my habits table. And I'll just click continue. And there you see I have 15 items with the habits that I am tracking. And once you have added a collection, you can display it on a page. So here we will quickly add a section and inside that section we will add a list because we have a collection so we have a list of items and here on the flex box on the list we added you see that uh, we have a list of items apple banana orange we will replace this we will remove this and instead we will go to our data tab here and bind to our collection so now you see it says object, object, what does that mean? And you see, I still only have one item. So the first child of the parent container, so the, the container where we bound our list of items, this uh, is repeated as many times as we have items in the collection. And now for the text, we can bind to, we can remove this and bind to the name of our habit. So now we see um, our list of habits.